Hello everybody, back here at the curb spot. Today is gonna be a progression session, hopefully get the wheels rolling on this trick that I've been wanting to do for a while. It's been a minute since I learned a new trick. We're gonna be going for no slide to crook. It's one I've always wanted to do. I got this curb right here, old faithful, and I know it's harder to learn on a decked curb instead of a double-sided curb. I also know it's possible. So I don't know if it's the best thing to learn on for this trick, but I'm gonna go for it anyway. So I'm gonna get warmed up on some no slides and then start just trying to figure it out. And hopefully by the end of the video, I'll get at least one or really close to one. I gotta say I'm not feeling particularly like confident in this trick. I just wanted to start getting the motions going. And I think what I'll have to do is a couple things different with my nose slide. I'm gonna have to, first of all, have my back foot out of here and more above the bolts if I can do that. Listen to old Robbie Rodriguez put my foot farther up instead of right here, farther up. And then dip the nose slide. So I can be sliding and then just I should be able to pop it up. So I don't know if I should go fast for this trick or slow or maybe I'll just take some baby steps and get some get some attempts in. Yeah, so these are just the first attempts. Messing around trying to get in the crook to see. Uh, yeah, I wasn't sure what to expect, but figured I'd just kind of start going for it. Right off the bat, I wasn't really getting close. I was like, oh man, what did I get myself into? And from doing it and watching the attempts, I figured some, I think I figured some stuff out, but I definitely, yeah, it, it's, it, was, it was a process, that's for sure. Okay, I just watched Robbie Rodriguez's video again just to freshen up. Yeah, I'm definitely making my life a little harder by doing it on this curb, by the double-sided curb, but that's making excuses. I never like to do anything the easy way. So, those last few attempts, I mean, I was, you saw, maybe you saw, I was adjusting my back foot because I thought that was messing with me. Maybe it is, maybe it's not, but we're just gonna keep trying. This is skateboarding. That's what we're doing here. I was already starting to get frustrated, and that one kind of gave me a little bit. I was like, "Okay, that maybe I can, maybe I can get this." And then I got another one like that, and I was like, "Oh, maybe we're onto something." And then it started going downhill really quickly, and I realized that maybe. So you can see right there, I added a bunch of wax to the to the blocks on the deck because this trick you got to lean into it. Like you gotta lean over and get that wheel over and with that deck there like that, it's just like coarse sandpaper. It just does not let you lean into it. So I have to like, I can't cheat this trick. If you go watch Robbie Rodriguez's video, he shows you how you can kind of cheat into it. I can't do that on this curb. And see, I got kind of close again. I was like, eh. But yeah, I can't do that on this curb. That doesn't mean it's not doable on this curb. And as always, I'm stupid and I'm stubborn. Like if you can do it on this curb, then I need to, I can learn it on this curb. But yeah, I started getting really, really frustrated and it's just turned into a, a, quite the battle. Oh, man, you guys, I'm getting freaking frustrated. I'm not even getting close. I'm gonna keep going until I run out of water and my battery dies. But look at the, right there. Just shredding my nose, it's making me hit the brakes, it's excuses, and it's not the curb, it's me, but it's making it more difficult. So 
Let's just keep going, I guess. One thing I was kind of figuring out by watching the footage back, um, I wasn't really getting that nolly, kind of that nolly that I wanted to get into it. You can see my full nose is on there. And when I go to try to get into the crook, it just, it stops me because I'm just trying to turn into it and just like muscle it into it, but that's not really working out. So I gotta try to get it dipped so I can get into it and see, yeah, the frustration is really kicking in right here. And at this point I was like, this is, no, I don't think this is happening. I can't lie, I'm feeling pretty, pretty shitty about myself right now. I don't know why, I'm doing something wrong, obviously. But maybe I can go through the footage and see. So this isn't a waste of time, but yeah, I'm feeling pretty down and, and frustrated. So I got 20% left on this battery. I got like a few chugs left of water. I'm just gonna finish it out and yeah, let's keep trying. Yeah, so at this point I was already like from an hour 10, hour 15 minutes into just doing this trick. I didn't land, besides a regular no slide, I didn't land a one trick the whole day. But my goal was to go out here and try this trick, so that's what I was doing. But, like I said, water run out or battery runs out. And I ended up getting one. Close. It obviously doesn't count, but here it is right here. And, yeah, to be continued, guys. This isn't the end of it, so here it is.